Hi and welcome to Fovatech TV, your station for photography and video product overview. Today we're going to be looking at the Daylight as well as the bicolor LED panel systems. Now this is one of those products that's great for both professionals as well as beginners because it's a really easy to use system. All you have to do is put it on a light stand, plug it in and turn it on and it's ready to go. Also LED lights are really great because they emit very very little heat and the bulbs last a really really long time. Also if you want to shoot offset uh, whether it's outside or wherever you want to go. It's really great because you can use a Sony V-Lock battery to just utilize it without any plugs. Also, there are barn doors which allow you to focus on how you want to direct your light. It could be, be very wide or very narrow depending on your needs. And the LED panel systems themselves are just very versatile, like I said. Uh, they could be used for YouTube videos, they could use, be used for interviews, testimonials, and a lot of other functions. The most common question we receive is, which LED panel should I buy? And there's two, two things you should consider. The first one is LED count. The second one is color temperature. In terms of LED count, we offer three different ones, the 600 count, the 900, and the 1200 count. And in terms of color temperature, there's the daylight as well as the bicolor. The daylight will consistently output about 5600 Kelvin color temperature or daylight, while the bicolor really gives you that ability to customize the color temperature based off your own needs. But now we're going to take a closer look at the 600 LED panels to really compare the difference between the daylight and the bicolor. Now we'll take a look at the back of the 600 LED panels. This is the daylight one with one knob. As you can see, it, it, you could turn it maximum all the way down to minimum. And here we have the bicolor. This is for the tungsten, which accounts for 50% of the bulbs. And this controls the daylight bulbs, which is the other 50%. We'll now demonstrate what it looks like and what that means. If we look at the front of the displays, this is the daylight, once again. This is at the minimum, and we can raise it all the way to the maximum. And this, the one knob will control all, this, all the lights at the same time. For the bicolor, this knob right here, this is for the daylight, so it'll turn on half the bulbs. Let's shut that off for now. And for the tungsten switch, it'll turn on the other 50%. And here it is with both daylight and tungsten on together at full power.